Max Bucks Setup. The Max Bucks Setup is where we activate the Max Bucks merchandising utility, customize the name of the Max Bucks Customer Loyalty Rewards Program, and set up the program parameters. From the menu bar, click Setups, select Marketing, and click the Max Bucks Setup from the side drop list to open the Max Bucks Merchandising Utility window. Check the Use Max Bucks Merchandising Utility box to activate the Max Bucks feature in the system and set the fields up on this screen. Enter the name you want to call your Max Bucks program, and this name can be up to 20 characters in length, including spaces, and prints on the repair orders and customer statements. Here we set the maximum amount of Max Bucks a customer can accumulate in total, let's say $250 worth of Max Bucks discounts. And down here, we set the amounts of the Max Bucks discounts that can be earned per repair order, then the amounts that can be used at any one time per repair order. Let's review here. The system treats the Max Bucks amounts as points, accumulated for amounts spent by your customers for work done at your shop that can be applied to future repair orders in the form of discounts. We just so happen to track those points as discount dollar amounts, easier for customers to understand. However, no financial amount is collected, exchanged, or paid out anywhere in the system for this rewards program. Now let's set up our program to give our customer discount points to use later on at a rate of 5% for labor sales, up to 50 bucks per RO, and the same for parts, 5% up to 50. Now that's if they pay with cash or check. Let's say I want to reward them less if they use a credit card, since I have to cover the credit card processing fees. So how about 3% up to 50 bucks on labor, and the same for parts. And for those jobs charged to accounts receivable, I'll just leave those at zero since I have to pay for the carrying costs anyway. Now let's figure out how much we want our customers to be able to use at one time. I would say they could discount their ROs at a rate of 10% for both labor and 10% for parts, up to $50 total discounts on the labor and the same towards the parts charges. Now I want to encourage them to come back another time for more work, so I don't want them to use up their entire discount balance in one visit, since I allow my customers to accumulate up to $250. When you're applying the Max Bucks discount, these percentages will determine how much of their available discount points they may apply to a single repair order. Note that there's not a separate bucket to collect parts points and labor points, but we've set it up so the customer can use only 10% towards the labor amount and 10% towards the parts amount. Now the system will apply the discount points available to the parts sales amount first to the maximum parts discount amount allowable, in this case $50. Then their discount is applied to the labor charges to the maximum labor discount amount of $50. Please see the MaxTrax Customer Retention Review video for more details about how to use the MaxBucks feature in MaxTrax. And this concludes the lesson on MaxBucks Setup.